Hello my dear friends hope you all are doing good today let's learn how to make this amazing animated flip book in powerpoint and if you don't subscribe our channel then hit the subscribe button now and get the updates daily so let's start i have took these two images from internet this one is outro page and this is the inner page that we are going to use in our flip book so first add our new slide then go to view and enable the guides then we will insert a rectangle draw it from half of the page as you can see make it no outline and click drop down menu and picture fill the shape for that i will first copy this outro image and click on picture fill then again insert a rectangle and change the dimensions of it make the height 1.7 and make the width 3 then make it no outline and fill with white color then go to effects and choose this top left inner shadow effect and reduce the transparency of it then go to shapes and select this arc shape increase the width of the shape i'm zooming the screen so that you can align the shapes properly arrange the arc like you can see on the screen i am doing and make the gradient fill then select both these shapes and group them now duplicate it to the end of the slide with control plus d then go to shapes and insert our text box write the text as per your choice then change the font style font size make it bold and change the font color then go to shape format and align the text to the middle and also give text shadow to make it look good now duplicate this slide delete the text box Then I will copy this inner page and change this background by clicking on clipboard. Now duplicate the shape and arrange it. Then send it to back. And select all these small rectangles and group them. Then we will send it to back. then duplicate the shapes and arrange to the end of the another book cover arrange the shapes accordingly then reduce the size of the arc by dragging the yellow point of the arc Now send back these small rectangles. Delete the previous arc. Now duplicate the first arc, arrange it and duplicate it to the end of the slide. Now select the both grouped shapes and make the shape color more darker. 
Here I am first using the eye dropper to take the color of background and then making it more darker to highlight the gaps in the diary. Now insert a rectangle for page. Align it middle. and sand to back from the small rectangles and make it no outline and fill the shape with white color give the shadow effect and change the transparency i will adjust the page little bit and it looks perfect now Now go to home and select a round shaped rectangle. Arrange it to the end of the page. Select the page, then select this rounded corner rectangle and subtract it. Now insert the rectangle Make it no outline and select the color of your choice and sand back to the page shape. Then give some shadow effect to it. Then insert the text box and write the page number. And then rotate it 90 degree left. then change the font color and font style now select all the three page elements and group all of them after that duplicate the slide and then duplicate the page and align it to the other side then rotate it horizontally and also change the shadow effect to left side now change the page number and colors of the page shape Now delete this last slide and here the time comes where we will insert the content for that we will change the background color of this white page i paste the copied image do the same with remaining white pages and send the page number 2 to back so here is my content i have already made this content so i am just doing copy paste here but you can make the content manually here according to your choice Now for the last page duplicate the first slide arrange it to the end of all of the slides then delete the text box rotate the shape horizontally and align it to the another side of the slide now select all the grouped shapes and rotate horizontally and align accordingly At last select all slides except first slide and apply the page curl transition. And here you go you have learned this animated flip book in PowerPoint today.